cars. But he always said that out of the 20 to 30 men that he would teach, maybe three of them would be successful. Mm -hmm. But he, he didn't look at it as a negative. He said, well, that means that those are three generations that are going to mm -hmm. improve and excel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So he didn't look at mm -hmm. it, oh, okay, there were 33, yeah. so I lost 30. He looked at it, I gained three, so there's many generations that, that will learn his craft or will learn to improve their lives. So that when, when you were talking about the affiliative leader, it reminded me so much of my father. So thank you for that. <coughs> Our fourth speaker is based on the time, I, so we can you know so we can have table topics. Mm -hmm. I'll forego my speech. Today. Oh, okay. So, so Lauren, mm -hmm. coming up. Our <laughs> table topics. Table well topics. Yeah. 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 I'm not evaluating anybody today. Uh, just because we we'll, we're running low on time, so we only have time for about three. So I, I, it wouldn't it wouldn't be fair if I went to give a speech. Sorry, Isaac. <laughs> <Lizzie. laughs> Table Topics is a fun time for impromptu speaking. You'll come up and I'll ask for volunteers, or I'll just pick someone who's not looking at me. And <laughs> 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 we'll just That's speak one thing. to two minutes on the topic. All right, so we'll have one of our own speak up so that you guys can see how it works. Uh, Lucy. Okay. <laughs> will be about luck. Okay. So, do you believe in luck? Do you believe in luck? Yes, I, I do believe in luck. I'm lucky to be here today. Okay. <laughs> I am lucky to have a very good uh, job and, and family, so absolutely, I'm truly grateful and lucky that, that I have all these great blessings. But. Lost my train of thought. Lucky, lucky. Well, um, <laughs> my train of thought, sorry. Hey, lucky to have Max. Lucky to have Max, yes. Mm -hmm. Lucky for all <laughs> of Max. Max is my puppy, he's a Havanese. Uh, yes, um, I don't know what else I can say about uh, luck besides the fact that you have to be grateful for what you have, for sure. And, um, you know, um, that's one thing that I do every morning is I, I always uh, I believe in God and I'm very grateful every morning. I say thank you, God, for another beautiful day and mm -hmm. that, you know, give me the strength to do all the great things. and. Be positive and, and stay positive and don't let anyone steal your joy. Uh, that's for sure one of the things that I uh, always say is uh, it's, you know, being grateful. that they have to go to financial classes to be able to learn how to manage that because they're not coming back to me for more. <laughs> um, so that's basically what I would do with it. I would want to give. I would want to be a blessing. But I would also put boundaries up where that is concerned so that... Um, going back to what was said earlier, there's generations that can, it can multiply. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to speak to the degree. So what, uh, gener uh, what communities would you give to, or what charity would you give to? Oh my goodness, there are so many um, 
things that are near to my heart. I do love animals. I absolutely love animals, but I also love the elderly. And one of the things that has always been on the back of my mind, my heart goes out to the elderly who, um, who have to go into the hospitals, but yet they don't have somebody to take care of their four-legged loved one or for their little bird or for their little fish. And to have a community of people to go and say, you know what? Miss Jones, you can go to the hospital, get yourself taken care of. We're going to take care of little Fifi for you and maybe have <laughs> some cool. type of um, community where we could have resources um, where that can happen. So that's one of the things that I, it's always been in the back of my mind to do. That is cool. Tim, thanks for volunteering. <laughs> Does this count as uh, icebreaker? Yeah. <laughs> you speak for four minutes, yes. <laughs> Great. If you could bestow luck upon someone, who would you choose and why? If you could bestow luck on someone, who would you choose and why? Yeah, right then, uh, what you mentioned about who I would bestow love upon, it would have to be myself because all of a sudden, lose my train of thought <laughs> but uh, if I would bestow love upon a person luck. pardon luck. oh luck <laughs> well that changes same it. person <laughs> <laughs> well uh, if I would bestow luck upon a person it would have to be a, a young lady uh, who was working over at uh, JC Penney's and one night I had, I had need of some new blue jeans. So I went over to the JC Penney's and as I was looking through the blue jean rack, I, uh, I found some trousers that were my size. And uh, unfortunately, while I had been working, I had uh, grown out of the, the trousers that I was wearing. So as I bent over, they kind of ripped. Uh, mm. And uh, because of that, I was in need of some new trousers. So as I went to J.C. Penney's, I, uh, my mission was to find this, this uh, pair of jeans. So I, uh, I, as I was going through there, I found my jeans. And uh, as I was looking, I also met a young lady. And I don't actually recall her name, but um, I, did I do recall the conversation that we had. Uh, as I was uh, talking to her, I... Uh, I began to share the gospel with her. If any of you have ever attended church, the gospel is some uh, information about having a relationship with God through Jesus Christ. So after sharing the gospel with her, uh, she, was, uh, she was interested a little bit, but not really quite interested and uh, because she was already attending a certain type of church. And, uh, but as we finished our conversation, took my jeans to the counter and, and purchased them and I started to leave and uh, as I was passing her I, I, I said okay man you, you have a, a great night and as I had uh, told her goodbye the music was playing over the loudspeaker and it was a, a song that, that started singing I need a savior <laughs> and uh, it was to me a sign that she actually needed something that day. Mm -hmm. And uh, although I couldn't bestow luck upon her, I could give her the, what we call the good news. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's what I gave her that day. Mm -hmm. Great. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, you oh, okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, Manny is the jeans. All right. I'd like to call up a general evaluator. Manny Reyes. Woohoo. Hola.